Okay, so on the other side of Brockett, Hiroshi is actually teamed with Christian, which is pretty dope. And we have Rids and Broke New. OC Mike and Odie, and Moses and Envy. But we're going straight into this, going to Battlefield first match. Yeah. It'd be safe to say these players love this stage. I feel like I feel like Peach is going to be the match changer. Like, we'll, be, we'll either be the match changer in a good way or a bad way, but we'll have to see what happens. Well, she's got to be the stock tank for sure. Yeah. But she's definitely getting kills right now, and that's working out for him. Like that's a that's a super benefit, honestly, if the stock yeah. tank is getting kills as well. Yeah, but right now, he caught on the other side of the stage, not able to help out his teammate, and um, Plup takes the first life off of Gatsu. All right, let's see. Fearless is gonna come back. He'll get to the ledge. He just hangs out with Rua to make a move. Okay. Well, I mean, he, he got in at least 15 damage, if not 20 on that last little bit of a stock. That was really good. Like, got to pull out the knee super quick off of that grab by Fearless. Right. That's just one of those things you should look for, though, as a Falcon player in yeah. teams. Kind of like your partner grabs him and your Jigglypuff. Like, come on, man. Just rest him. They're not even wiggling out. That was a brutal down smash by Fluff, though. Caught everyone out of there. And it looks like neither one of them was comfortable enough to try to challenge Plup's neutral just now. Yeah. I don't know, dude. Plup is scary. Honestly. <laughs> oh, but good back air catching him all over that forward air. All right, Gatsu's got to be careful. He's only got two stocks here. All right, nice neutral air because both of them. And if they get this edge guard, this could make it even. Yeah. Oh, but Ooh. good laser. I think it would have come back anyways, but that... I feel the laser helped him just a little more. Well, that was a really good juke there from Fearless. <laughs> He's just like, all right, I'm not going to do anything. And that was the best trick. All right, so it's even, guys. Yeah. Unfortunately, Fearless tried to combo off Falco that moment, and then got caught by the back air off of Sheik. All right, Rula does a good job of covering. He gets a really quick wave land off. Good uh, stuff, good like dash tax. Good forward air. Yeah. That's going to do it. Oh, but Gatsu misses his knee. Oh, but here right. we go. Gets one across the stage. That's fine. That's fine. Everything's fine. All right. Oh, tries, oh, tries to, tries to get the recovery, one. but doesn't quite capitalize on it. And then gets back aired in the process. Oh, man. All right. If uh, Peach can stay alive and not take another, like, 30 damage. That'd be good. All good right. for them, for sure. All right. Falco needs to do something. <laughs> All right. Sheik's got him. Oh, this, that forward air was just was unnecessarily strong. Plop is... We're, like he's recovering from all of these hits, straight hits, and I'm pretty sure he's also taken all of Gatsu's life so far. Yeah. Um, well, for the most part, Peach, Falco, and teams, like Peach is going to keep you preoccupied. If you can't laser, you're like not Falco. All right, Gatsu's just got to stay alive. If they can get this kill on Sheik, this is over. Oh, good recovery. Good oh, recovery. But Falco gets it. Oh, oh all right. We got right now, we're 1v1. I don't know. Would you say is this matchup in Peach's favor? Um, no. <laughs> oh, really? I think both these characters can do pretty substantial damage to each other, but in the long run, um, I think Falco is the worst of the high tiers. Yes, but she's still Peach. Like she's still really easy to combo. If you can combo floaties, then you got this. Uh, Flops is tech though. Do you say Falco is the worst of the high tiers? Yes. Do you think he's worse than like Peach and? And she can really? honestly sometimes buff, yeah, because he's just too much of a glass cannon. Like he can do a ton of damage, but if he can't laser, he has nothing. Like he can pillar you, but it'd be no different than like a fox pillaring you, honestly. Like that gun makes a huge difference, and even then, also his recovery is just not on par with the rest of the characters. Yeah, oh, that's for sure. Oh, oh unfortunate. Almost side beats off the ledge there. Nice shine grab. But right now, Rula, dude, is dude, he's doing super good work. He's just doing a really good job there of not challenging things he doesn't need to. Mm -hmm. All right, Fearless looks like he's going to wake up, but he doesn't want to jump into a back air. He's got to be careful of that. Oh, a neutral air. Yeah. And now Not they're both quite. at death percent. Almost any straight hit will kill both of them. Oh, now. that back air will do it. Yeah, nice. Wait patiently, and then he gets it. That was good stuff by Rula. The good comeback, dude. Yeah. Especially after killing his own teammate and yeah. taking his stock. <laughs> yeah, it's a couple of flubs. But it's like, I got you, bro. No worries. Yeah, we got this. We're in there. Yo, so there's like this Brazilian place that opened right over there where Matt Hires used to be. And it's dope because now I can drink that Brazilian soda I'm always drinking. Oh, man. Yo, they had some great soda at the monthly. Oh. Gods and Monsters has top tier soda. Oh, really? Yes. Hell yeah. All right, back to Battlefield. 
All right, Gatsu is racking up this damage on this Sheik. Or he was, and then she did the double back here. So I have, um, I have uh, a theory on commentator's curses, and I'll have to tell you about that okay. before we switch over to, to singles. But, like, you know how that's such a big thing? Uh, there's a reason for it, I think. 